Hey everyone, welcome back to my playthrough of Lives of P. It's your favorite pastry. And as you can see, I finally did it. I beat the King of Puppets. It only took me two dozen tries in an hour and a half. I even had to go onto the, the interweb and figure it out. But let's continue on. Ooh, new dungeon. Let's go back and level up first. Since I deserve it. Or maybe not. Totally gonna regret this decision. But it looks like there's a record back here somewhere. I think I know who has it. I just need to remember how to get back to it. Ooh, frame drops. Is it up here? Here you go. Slightly close. Oh, there's another record. Oh no. Fascination. Do you remember the moment you fell in love? Nope. Do you remember the moment you fell in love? The moment when you were the only two people in the world. That splendid, magical moment when all your sinus was forgotten. A heavenly voice represents Krat, a gift from the red actress Adelina Corday to you. Fascination. Oh. I didn't mean to do that. Antonia's condition is getting worse. I knew it would come to this. The petrification disease locks people inside a cage, inside their own bodies. We're all safe, thanks to her sacrifice. But I wish for a miracle to save everyone. Me as well. I'll use my power to help. Note left at the counter. There's something I want to tell you, Geppetto's puppet. Please come to the Hotel Garden on the way to Elysium Boulevard. But seen. And I am in my donkey outfit.
Yeah, that's not creepy at all. Oh, it's you. Come closer, won't you? When you reach a certain age, it's a comfort to reflect on old memories. That's a portrait of me when I was young. <laughs> I was so feisty, so fierce back then. I loved the world, and the world loved me back. The passion of those days is long gone, but I still dream of those memories. I'm curious what your young eyes see. Is there any resemblance between me and that portrait? Do I still have a <laughs> It seems Gepetto even taught you good manners. That was new. Yes, those beautiful memories are still vivid in my mind. Time. Time and the memories that fill it are all we have. I hope you're making some good memories of your own. It may be a comfort to you someday. Ergo is whispering. People have no idea. Thanks for keeping. Let's see if there's anything new with the piano. Doesn't look like it. That book reminds me. Have you ever heard the fairy tale of all of Crot? Yeah, but this who? Same old, same old. Ooh, that's right. I completely forgot. I got a bunch of stuff. Burnt White King's Ergo. Ergo obtained from Romeo, King of Puppets. It is packed with immense power. When the boy opened his eyes, he found himself sitting on a throne that he had not asked for. When he sought his friend of the past, he clung to his memories even though he knew there was no going back. We were definitely friends in the past. I could have swore I got something else. calls for a great warrior let's see puppet ripper corpus is called the puppet ripper quick upward slash storm spinning slash puppet ripper a chain sickle handle that once sprayed a bloody fog over crop the spring device allows the handle to extend or wind up the chain easily Crot has a legend about a grinning hiddenness murder they say his heart was made of clockwork. Ooh. An amulet that can be equipped on a puppet. There were three bodies, but their mind was one. The mind that sought revenge against the puppets by killing them the way their brother was killed. Interesting. Let's go into the garden. Polandina. There he is. Is it Polandina? Welcome, good yeah. sir. Yeah. At last, we speak frankly instead of with professional reserve. I have something to confess. Something involving your unique perspective. I am a puppet whose ego has awoken. I don't know exactly why and... We need not dwell on the details. Instead, I wish to dwell on the welfare of Lady Antonia. I... 
the door, Lady Antonia. It is a presumptuous feeling for a puppet to have, to be sure. I have no intention of putting myself forward, of course. However, I cannot watch her die. It's too painful. Thus, I need your unique perspective. You exist somewhere between human and puppet. Can a puppet and a human fall in love? Have you ever met a puppet who loves a human? It exists indeed. An unbelievable love to be sure. With a wedding ring as its symbol. I fear even trying to pursue such a splendid happiness. I have no intention of telling her, of course. It wouldn't be proper to burden someone so frail. If I may be frank, this is better than I dared hope. Even if you are telling me a sweet lie, I shall savor it. Thank you. It was wise to confide in you. Thank you for granting me that wisdom. No matter what fate brings us, serving her is my welcome to hope. Hmm. The puppets are becoming more human-like. But yeah, for the record, we're gonna listen to it on as we ex close out, as per usual. Did my nose get bigger? Nope. Doesn't look like it got, bi get got bigger. And father isn't here. Of course he isn't. Or maybe he's here and he just hasn't loaded in. My computer is a potato. These three. Need one more quartz. Wait, did Palindina have one and I just didn't pay attention? Probably. I keep on forgetting I can infinite sprint while at Hotel Crop. No matter what, serving welcome. Does Vinini have anything new? Ah, I heard you defeated the King of Puppets. Amazing. Ah, the Puppets appear lost without their leader. They have no purpose, no focus. To think one can have so much control through ergo waves. If we don't determine who or what is causing it, this could all happen again tomorrow. I fear I must call upon you again, my friend. Please gather records of the puppet's ergo waves while you're defeating them. I always welcome friends. Hmm. Don't like that Geppetto's missing. There we go. There he is. Another cutscene. I'm glad you're safe. 
I was so scared I would lose my precious son. It's risky for me just being out here. I'm sure it is. Fortunately, you didn't need my help. I'm so proud that I got to see my son defeat the king. Hopefully the lesser puppets will die down soon. Now that the king is dead, the puppets have no leader, no direction. But the curse of the petrification disease still lingers. It's tough, but I know where you should go now. The Grand Exhibition. Rumors say the alchemists there have developed a cure. As a man of invention, I'm skeptical of the alchemists, both their science and their motives. But they may be the city's last hope. Won't you help me, son? Take this. You'll find it most useful. If it will help Antonia and the others, it's worth exploring. Go to the Grand Exhibition and see what you can find. More pulse cells. That was useful. Charity Market Path. Rainy day. Ambush. Ambush. Do do do. I have a feeling that the cure for the petrification disease that the alchemist came up was those carcass creatures. Is that a dog with a saw in its mouth? That it? Nope. Its mouth or head is a saw now. What will science think of next? Ooh, cluster grenade. What's going on? All these puppets look utterly down, depressed even. And that seems weird. That's weird, right? I think they're mourning the loss of their king. Or were they mourning the loss of this person? Hmm. I feel kind of bad. Maybe they won't bug me if I don't bug them. Okay. That was no. They still bug me. Ah, 
I thought that said Durham Ergo Crank. What are you? Clock sword? Excuse me? Bell of Provocation. Briefly taunts surrounding enemies to increase the attack of both the character and the enemies. Fascinating. A smart sword made, uh, made to commemorate the construction of the clock tower it is sharpened to a point in the shape of a minute hand, making it effective as for slashing and stabbing. The clockwork sword was made to commemorate the clockwork's construction by using its minute hand. Yes, even its blade was engraved with, with antique ornamentation. People said it was, fitting, it was a fitting commemorative item. The clock. Kinda looks like a pen. Not bad. Not for my build. That was way closer than it should have been. He was quite a bit stronger than I thought she was going to be. <gasps> Lorenzini Arcade, finally! Need to get that item th for that one lady from way back at the start of Rosa Isabella Street. I have exactly one throwing cell. Those two seem to not be interested in me. Let's press on. I feel like this was a stronghold. Hi. Oh, we're back to the zombies. Hmm. Something scary is going to pop out. I was right. Let's just get some thermite going.
Let us give you. Can I go this way? Nope. This screams ambush. <gasps> That's not screaming ambush. It is a stargazer. Oh, so many directions to go. By that I mean two, which is more than what you usually get. Can't break the window. It's zero of ten game. What are you? Does he explode? He does not explode. Need a key. Well, that's new. Can't go that way either. Oh, it's you. Have a fireball. Have another one. Here, have a fireball. Well, that was kind of disappointing. He was just five feet away. He has a grab. Can I? I can pop them. Those birthing pods, they're birthing pods, aren't they? I have to go this way, don't I? Yep. 
Yep, we were still pretty easy. Oh god, kid puppets. Got an achievement for killing all types, or for all of the butterfly kills. You're gonna follow me, aren't you? Six, seven, eight, nine. <laughs> Advanced technique walking backwards. This better be wine. You again. You're still alive. Not anymore. That was the wrong way. It was this way I wanted. Brain suckers from Bloodborne, that's what they remind me of.
Oh, am I still alive? Okay, this guy is quite a bit more tougher. for a new part. There it is. Made or item specific to Lada, the proper parts workshop. It has been in use for a long time, so despite being heavy, it is reliable. Okay, you are dead. Not enjoying the random screaming of people. You are also dead. I'm gonna assume you guys are also dead. Charity House Concert. Uh, let's just go over here. Do, do, do. All of you are invited to the concert being held at the Mona Charity House. Be prepared for the successful opening of the exhibition. Children sponsored by the Mona Charity House have a message of love and hope for all of you. Don't miss this chance to listen to the most innocent performance in all of Crot. Date and time XXX 1800. Place learns a Arcade Central Plaza, sponsored by Liza, Lady Isabel and Sophia M. <gasps> Sophia M, our level up lady? All profits from this performance will go toward our lesser fortunate neighbors. You know, I'm expecting to find some wine. Underground such key. Here, have some fire. Easy magazine. That's a big lad. Please? Nope. Oh god, there are multiples of them.
Oh, you hit hard. Am I being a coward? Yes, I am. That is why I'm being a coward. Oh my. This run back is going to be interesting. I wonder if I can just sprint like a mad lad. Those barrels just popped into existence. It looks like it can sprint like a mad lot. Does he always drop a Legion magazine? Here, have a fireball. Here, have another fireball. I hope he doesn't respond. See, I can target them. Oh my word. Oh. Please don't respond.
I am very much so running out of resources. Nice little shop. I am expecting an ambush. I should turn on my lamp because it's kind of dark in here. There we go. Is this a shortcut, finally? That's where this leads to. Leads. Scandal. B. The charge behind the flamboyance. Dear citizens of crap do not know who V is. The Crown Prince of High Society, the man who came up with the Grand Covenant of the Automated Puppets and built the best manufacturing company at the age of 18. Interesting, this is Fanini, isn't it? The man who is always fancy and is passionate about making people laugh. V is the most hated and beloved man in Krat, but his innocent passion makes him the opponent's sentimental. Makes even his opponent's sentimental. I cannot read right now. However, even fewer people are aware of the tragedy he experienced in his youth. The true nature of the death of V's parents was covered up, especially their victims of homicide during a mugging. Even though V experienced such a tragedy in his youth, he grew up with a cheerful personality and became a well-known person whom many any parents would be proud of. However, there is no one know who knows what... <sighs> However, there is no one who knows that V secretly requests for the case history every year and that his request is always denied. Suspicion surrounding this tragedy at the time, and there is known to have been pressure from the workshop and the alchemist throughout the investigation. The most interesting hypothesis is that the murderer is not human. If this is true, it explains the workshop and the alchemist's suspicions, suspicious attempts to cover it up. It also explains how V was obsessed with inventions and success from his youth. This is where the real tragedy of Krat lies. Even V, the richest and most influential, influential, even V, the richest and most influential in all of Krat, can't come close to their power. On the other hand, this fact includes another truth. Have you noticed? The state's censorship is keeping me from writing it, but as a writer, I'm curious if people are ready to accept the truth. The truth that there is a murderer made of steel that walks among us. Perhaps our world of Krat is not such a safe place after all. Hmm. I'm just thinking that the workshop and alchemists work together to make it make crap what it is right now. Underground passage. Who are you? A lost visitor or a looter who's arrived too late? You look like a stalker. I figured you were all dead. <laughs> no offense. Stalker, visitor, looter, I don't care. Just buy what you need and leave. Does he have... Oh, hello. Circular electric chainsaw blade. A scaling in advance. Yes, please. And now see. Indomitable amulet. Increases resistance of disruption, shock, and break. Their determination does not falter in the face of any difficulty. They continue to resist and defy even in situations where moving proves impossible. He was a lifesaver. Oh, this is where I am. Can I remember?
remember where the door I need is. Of course not. Oh, it was this one right here. I have to run through that, don't I? This is where that Amelie comes in play. An occult club moment, if you will. I, for some reason, don't want to go through that. Greatest show on earth is coming. Ooh, sabers. Okay, I think I'm kind of safe. Biggest show on earth is coming to Krat to make your heart race. Dear ladies and gentlemen, introducing the Grand Exhibition of Inkrat, the city of tomorrow, the center of the new age, state-of-the-art machines, balloons spread across the city, and a popular performance that toured from across the great desert in the south to the country in the far east. Don't forget the essence of the automated poet, the center of Krat's revival. The greatest show awaits you all. Nini tram, new butler pound pits, special exhibition gallery, treasure from the far east. Ah, excuse me. I wonder if this is the way, capital T, capital W. Or if this is an optional side map. It's starting to feel like it's the way. Oh, creepy screaming again. I have a feeling- Oh my god! I'm just going to let this happen. Oh. That legitimately startled. But those Karkos enemies were my savior. Balance crank. Please tell me this is wine. <gasps> yes! Finally!
Volunteers wanted. Grand exhibition. I dream of becoming a real girl. Sorry, mate. I didn't. Sorry, Bob. I did not want you to pop out and startle me. Uh, hello? Is anyone there? Is this Vinini? Calling any and all stargazers in the vicinity. Please respond. Over. So that was the way. Good point. Let's turn in these quests. Sophia wants to talk to us. Listen to a record and call it a day. A lot of star fragments. Was oh, this the lady? Yeah. Ah, lovely wee. Even in the bottle, it has a distinctive shade of red. Oh, thank you, young one. Every step is a struggle when you have the petrification disease. This, this glimmer of happier days is priceless. Oh, why, you almost forgot. They're speaking of price. Here's what I can spare. Please, take it. A Nini commemorative coin. Commemorative coin, obtained as a thank you gift from the old lady at the window. It is engraved with Vinini's face. The Vinini commemorative coins were minted for a limited edition for the Vinini fan club's anniversary. It was a magnificent event, attended by socialites and celebrities. That is going to be useful later on, I know. off to fight the king but this it's a necklace from the Mona charity house they took care of orphans and impoverished children from across Krat. many of those children grew up at the rose estate and became alchemists technicians and stalkers i hope the king didn't harm any of them or don't tell me the king's ergo is actually... Are you okay? You look ill ever since I mentioned the necklace. My heavens, you look... I think I know what's going on. Carlo. My name is Carlo. My hair grew. Just keep behaving. Keep 
feeling like a human does. You might just hold the true secret of Ergo. My hair grew. Didn't know this because I was wearing masks this entire time. Kinda cute. But that tragedy we heard about at the orphanage. I think Carlo, me, and Romeo were two of the people that were that died at that tragedy. I'm thinking Geppetto couldn't let us go, so he turned us into puppets. Took our souls and put us into puppets. That's why we're special. Makes me think. Is Palindina a real person, or was a real person, and I was turned into a puppet. I'll use my power to help you. You level up twice. And let's go try this guy out. That's slow and heavy. I kind of like it though. Con is sending slash slash enemies in front of you. The number of slashes varies depending on the charged amount. Endure. I already love it. Yep, I already love it. Oh, that's what that symbol is. Endure. Hidden Moonstone. No matter what serving her, welcome to her. I need a seven, right? Two more. I did not realize I had so many crescent moonstones. Go plus five. 108 and six for physical attack, 97 six for electric. That is already better than my old hammer. Well, as promised, listen to the record <clears throat> as we leave. But as always, I'm rooting for you. We're all in this together. <laughs>